what is up YouTube welcome back to my channel hooked on fish today I'm going to be talking to you guys about the giveaway I'm going to be having when I get to 100 subscribers get over to this pond near my house because I want to show you guys what it looks like really quick as well so see you guys in a second Oh yeah, I forgot it's winter time. <sighs> well, it looks like you guys won't be seeing what the pond looks like under the water today. But, uh, you'll see the size. I have a couple questions for people who fish ponds a lot. But, uh, that ice got pretty thick. Huh. Cool. Alright, let's get to the dock. Alright you guys, so basically <laughs> what is uh, going on here is I'm going to be having a, not big, but a good size giveaway once I make it to 100 subscribers. Should be fairly soon, I only have 40 left. I think I'm at 59 or 60 subscribers, which is uh, awesome. I'm really glad when I got to 50 subscribers I got pretty hyped. I've had this channel for almost... Nearing in on like five months now, I think. So that's pretty awesome that I already almost made it to 100. Um, anyway, I'll tell you guys what I'll be giving away once I get to 100 after I clean off this lens. <sighs> All right, so what I'm gonna be giving away is uh, pretty cool. I'm gonna be giving away, I'm gonna do a lot of research and I'm gonna be giving away either, I think two baits per season but it's going to be, so I'm going to give away my top, or the top two baits for uh, springtime, top two baits for uh, uh, summertime, top two for fall, and top two for winter. And that'll add up to eight baits, and they're not going to, they're most likely not going to be pretty cheap. So you'll be getting eight baits that you, that you can use. I'll have them marked in little packages saying, saying what season for which. And uh, I'll, I'll send that to whoever wins. Um, but I'll be posting up another video once I am around like 90 something subscribers. So let everyone you know, uh, know that I'm going to be having this giveaway very soon. And to go subscribe to my channel. If you're watching this video and you haven't su subscribed, please subscribe. Because in order to win the giveaway, you need to be subscribed. And uh, so yeah, stay tuned to my channel, you guys. Make sure you let everybody know that doesn't know already. And once I near 100, I'll put up the video where you guys will actually win, uh, win what's going on. But, uh, yeah, now comes the questions about this pond. So this pond right here, guys, it's a pretty decent size. It's, it's close to, like, an acre, I think, which I think is a good size to start holding bass. It's got a river flowing in here and a little drainage pipe here that's, it's got a little drainage thing right there to drain the water and uh, it flows off that way when the water's higher um so the water is always moving there's a great source of food there's bluegill uh just some minnows and there's crawfish and lizards and frogs and a bunch of stuff and i was wondering if you guys thought this would be an appropriate size to uh stock some little little bass in because it'd be fun to go frog it in like the in the summertime and just kind of come out here for leisure and fish for some little bass that might grow to be pretty big. I mean, this place has really, really good food source. So, if anybody knows, if anybody knows about stocking a pond or uh, what what requirements are or anything, please leave a comment below and let me know because I'm thinking about possibly stocking this or like calling someone to stock it is what I'd be doing. So, uh, if you guys know anything about uh, like size or what kind of food source or uh, how big the bass are that you need to stock. Let me know in the comments. And uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and let everybody know to subscribe to my channel because at 100 subscribers, there will be an eight lure giveaway for each and every season of the year. So stay tuned, subscribe. Catch you guys next time.